Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. And thank you for watching another motivational cleaning and decorating video with me in this life of mine. Today I'm sharing a much needed and long awaited cleaning and decorating video with you. We've been in our home for almost a year now. And as I shared before, we have finally found the vision of what we want our home to look like. And the time has finally come to start that process of decorating. If you've been active with me over on Instagram or my community tab here on YouTube, then you know that our home has just been a complete disaster and I've been working on cleaning, decluttering, organizing, and getting it all back in order. As a busy wife and mom of three, times can get pretty chaotic and even turn into a catastrophe around here. So I'm excited to share how I clean and revamp my spirit and our home with cleaning and decorating. And if you enjoy motivational videos like this, I would love to have you join my family here on YouTube where I share all the things in this life of mine that pertains to motherhood, cleaning, decluttering, and decorating our home as a young adult. Today I wanted to really focus on our bedroom and get everything clean and put into its correct place. We have some things that we need to get removed from our room as well as rearrange a few things. So I'm focusing on getting the space clean to do what I need to do so our room feels refreshed. After a busy week that we've had, we needed to feel good within ourselves. And what better way to do that than to refresh where you lay your head. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know what happened. And I honestly just want to say thank you to each and every person that reached out to us to check on myself, Jaden, and our car. To clean the surfaces and the glass in our bedroom, I'm using our Thieves Household Cleaner. It doesn't leave it completely streak free, but it does its job. I know I talk about this all the time, but I absolutely love it. It is my crowning glory cleaner. I really love it, and during times like this, with the seasons changing and the spring allergies, it is my go-to to help fight that. In our bedroom, we had a lot going on and I really wanted to focus and narrow down and get things done. So I didn't too much worry about decluttering and organizing our dresser, especially since I just filmed a laundry video right after this, which I'll be sharing with you guys in a couple days. So I just went ahead, put our clothes where they needed to go and moved on so I didn't get stuck and start procrastinating about moving on to the next thing just to get that one thing done.
The dresser that we have is from Big Lots. We absolutely love it. It is a big step up from what we had before and our favorite thing about it is of course the space. And while I'm here, the desk that we have is from Amazon. It's one of our favorite Amazon buys. We got it for me to work and edit as well as my Cricut projects, but today is gonna to get completely cleared to be moved into the new office space. Oh, and by the way, my chair is for Amazon too. It is my favorite chair ever. So I know you guys see Jonah, he is sitting right beside me. He just wanted some chest time with me. He was a breastfed baby, so sometimes we just have to cuddle up together so he can just feel good on the inside to revamp his spirit whenever he's having a hard time. But whenever I came back, I just continued to move the shelves. I was gonna put those into London's room. We are gonna be decorating her room soon. And then I went ahead and got things ready so I can start cleaning the closet because I didn't move our desk until that evening. Here in our closet, I just wanted to get things picked up. As you guys can see, it is a catastrophe, you guys. And that is because it is not very well organized and that is something that I do need to get done. So pretty soon, I will be doing a complete organization of our closet. If you would like to see that video but you are not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and you hit that bell so you don't miss out whenever I post this video because I'm excited to go in and just completely organize our closet so it stops getting like this.
While I was vacuuming our space, I did see some areas on our rug and our carpet that just needed a good deep clean. So I pulled our rug up to get that done. And if you've been here, then you've seen me tackle our rugs in the front of our home. So this is the first one that we're gonna tackle in the back of our home, as well as our carpet in our bedroom. So I was excited and it felt so refreshing once I was done with that. I know it's been a while since you guys have seen our bedroom, so I wanted to share where things were from and also let you guys know that I do have them linked in my description box. However, the rug that we have, this was a switch around project. We originally had it in the boys room, which is another reason why it needed to be deep cleaned, but we moved it in here when we got the curtains, but the rug is from the at home store and the curtains are from Walmart. I will have the first video linked in my description box of me decorating our bedroom so you guys can see where we started and kind of how far we've come. I did share where we got things from in that video too, but let me know what you guys think of it in the comments if you do watch it. I'm using our Bissell carpet cleaner. It's specifically made for pets, so that's a plus, and it's easy to use. I paired it with the Bissell Pet Pro Oxy Stain Destroyer. We got both products from Walmart, and I think they are very easy to use, and also affordable for a family under a strict budget, but you still need to get good power tools. For Jaquin and myself, we are a very young adult family, so it took us a while to get all the power tools that we need to clean our home, especially when it comes to deep cleaning. So with that being said, we wanted to find the right tools at the right price, you guys. And we've just kind of been sticking with Bissell products and Shark products.
So here I'm just trying to share a real life clip of deep cleaning our carpet, you guys, because even though I try to vacuum in here before I actually deep clean it, there is still so much hair that is left behind that I pick up with our carpet deep cleaner. So I'm really happy and it feels so refreshing just knowing that we don't have this hair there anymore. Oh, I think I forgot to say it earlier, but the vanity that I have is from Amazon. I do love it. There are a few things that I don't like about it, but for the most part, I love it. So I'll have it linked down in my description box too. So I also wanted to go into our bathroom to give it a good deep clean before I added decor to our bedroom the next day. I'm using our Clorox wand cleaner on our toilet and the all purpose bleach cleaner to wipe it down. To clean our bathtub, I just went ahead and used some Scotch-Brite. I did put some hot water on my pad just to make sure I can give it a good deep clean. I did spray it down with some bleach cleaner as well, but that was before I realized, let me not mix this. So I just went ahead and used some hot water to scrub it down. I did the walls as well. And the scrubber that I'm using, I believe we picked this up from Walmart. So here we are the next day. I wanted to share with you guys how the room was looking because I know that you guys saw me 
and I did think I was going to rearrange the room but I decided to keep the room like this and just rearrange the dresser and move my vanity but here's all the decor that we have and I'm super excited to share with you guys how everything is looking and what we have and just how we're going to transform the room today to just refresh our spirits and just finally get the ball rolling on our home decor. So here we have two new pillows. Jake and I decided to go on the brand Copper. We got these pillows before and we really love them. So we decided to keep up with this. And then I went ahead and got some new sheets for our bed. I got these from Walmart. I got them in the color blue because the original sheets that I wanted, they did not have it, you guys. So I'm going to wait a little while and I'm going to go back and get that. But for now, I went ahead and got blue. And then here are the pillow covers for the back pillows. And I wasn't too sure if it was going to match this comforter because you guys, I got this comforter a couple months ago, but I just got these I just got these pillow covers and I just wasn't sure if they were going to match, but I feel like they match pretty well, so it won't look too bad. And then I have this throw blanket along with this throw blanket. However, I don't think I'm going to be using them how I originally planned on using them because I might try to do like a hotel style bed so I don't know if I'm going to use both of these how I originally planned so so we'll see what's going to happen with that as we go on however I did also get some pillow covers and also a mattress protector for our bed and the kids bed because we really do need them I've always used pillow protectors that way we can keep our pillows clean and fresh especially with three little ones running around they get their little sticky fingers on everything so I went ahead and picked up these Aller Ease Spa Comfort pillow covers I really love them because all the added benefits especially when it comes to allergies and other things and then so I also got this super cute little throw pillow and then I also have these three throw pillows now obviously you guys can see what color I am going with with our room we are loving blue I don't think I'm going to get rid of the blue I do know that it is a lot of blue however it all won't be stacked on top of each other if that makes sense so this is going to all come together and I'm super excited to share that with you guys I really love the mattress protector that I added. I was concerned because it's made from plastic material, but you can't really tell by the feel of it. On the other hand, I loved how it covered everything up and I was able to just zip it all up. The instructions called to remove the mattress pad before adding the protector, but without the mattress pad, our bed is very uncomfortable. And since this didn't have extra padding, I kept it. I was surprised it all still fit, but it was easy to put on as well as I didn't have to remove our mattress, which the instructions called for too. Try, try 
what to do, say anything. So normally on a not so stressful and busy day, I do love to wash all of our bedding and new things that we get before we wear them or add them to our bed. However, if you guys saw the laundry that we were dealing with, you would know why I am just adding this to our bed so we can have some fresh sheets and new linen to sleep on and just feel good at the end of the night. When it comes to decorating our bed and room to match our design preferences, especially when working in a renter home, we wanted our staple pieces to really be bold and stick out. That's a huge tip for you guys to take along with you when decorating your home, especially when working on a budget. With going this route, our filler decor doesn't have to be much to show the look that we're going for. That is what my heart says. That's what my heart says. I wanna be with you always. You are my world in every place. It's the things I do do. And it's the sign of I did decide to add some new lamps to our bedroom because the old set of lamps that we had, we only had one. So I did go ahead and pick up some new lamps. The lamps along with all the other decor that we have in our bedroom came from the at home decor superstore. You guys know I love shopping there. We always find so many good finds. I've already found some Christmas decor y'all for our bedroom and I'm super excited to share with y'all what I have. But as far as that, I added some new lamps and then I also wanted to go ahead and officially finish our gallery wall. If you guys saw in our last video, decor, room decor video, you saw that I did add about three, maybe four pictures above our dresser right here. But I always knew I wanted to do a gallery wall of Jaquin and I, but we never got all the picture frames. And I was so excited when I went to the at home store and picked up these picture frames for only $7 a piece, you guys. I feel like that was such a steal because they are so beautiful and they kind of match the picture frames that we had before, which I just moved and rearranged throughout the rest of our home.
So when I first started putting the throw blankets on the bed, here you guys see, I didn't really know what direction I wanted to go in and the bed didn't really turn out exactly how I wanted it to turn out. So I know you guys can't see the third throw blanket because it's underneath our comforter, but we have another blue one along with the gray one and the blue one that you guys see here. And I didn't really know what direction I wanted to go in on the first day, but after I slept on it and I had some time to think about it and Jake went had some time to come in the room and help me out, y'all we came up with the the perfect layout and I really do love it but you guys will see that at the end of the video however I'm really curious to know if you guys liked any of the layouts of the throw blankets that I did have here up in the video because I thought they looked good watching it back Here on our dresser, I just had a few pieces of decor that I felt like would be a really great start to the decor around our room. And so you guys can see the vision for how we want the decor around our home and our bedroom to be. Of course, you guys know we had to add in the pumpkin for fall because I'm super excited about fall. It's one of my favorite seasons. But I just wanted to share with you guys the few decor pieces that we got just to add around the room to really just bring it to life. One of the things my mama taught me and still continues to teach me till this day is that you don't need a lot of decor to make your vision come to life or at least see the start of it. As long as you have decor pieces that are impactful and bring you joy, it'll all come together in the end. And one of the things I love about the at-home store is that you can find some really great items at some low prices. A lot of this decor that we have can even be found at TJ Maxx or Marshalls too. Right now, I'm just gonna go ahead and vacuum the floor because I do have to deep clean this section in our room. It took me some time to move our desk to the utility room for the new office space, but we got it done, so I went ahead and finished off the room by deep cleaning our carpet over here in this section.
Alrighty you guys, that is the end of today's cleaning video and I want to say thank you to every one of you for watching another motivational cleaning and decorating video in this life of mine. I feel like this is a great start to our home updates and this will go in our playlist called Project Bedrooms and this is episode one. I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!